XOR. XOR. What does XOR do? 0, 0 is 0. 1, 1 is 0. 0, 1 is 1. 1, 0 is 1. All we got all and nine not. So for nine, the threshold will be minus two, right? Not zero. If you have one, one and zero as the weights. Sorry. Nine. Nine means uh, it is zero only for one, one. Zero only for one, one. one, one. Okay, so it should be minus one. Minus, one. So minus two. Threshold. Uh, if the weights are minus one minus one zero, which you said, uh, then threshold should be. Yeah, threshold should be minus two or minus three. For now. What is the value you got? Can I tell any of you? For 9, W2, W1, W1, W2 and K. W0 will be 1, W1 will be 2 will be minus 1. K will be 1. Minus 1, minus 1, 1. So 9 is useful when both of them are 0, right? Otherwise, both anything which goes below minus 1, yeah. So that's also one thing. Minus one, minus one, one, and k is one. Got it? Minus one, minus one, one, and k will be one. So if both are zero, this will be one is equal to one, so you give you one. But if one of them is one, this goes to further down, right? It goes below one because it's minus one plus one. It will go to zero, which is less than one. So it will go to zero. So minus one, minus one, one, and Threshold is 1 for NAND. Now try for SOR. What is SOR? 0, 0 is 0. 1, 1 is 0. 0, 1 is 1. 1, 0 is 1. Equal to one. If the weighted sum is equal to the threshold, then only you output as one. If the weighted sum is not equal to threshold, you touch zero. Okay. Do that. Format is a thresholding function. Oh, means like you can't equate it to the threshold. Quick, you can equate. Oh, means like equal. above or equal and below. Two classes. But can't we? You can't do like one above, one below, equal. It doesn't matter. That's with threshold. With below the threshold, it is some value. Above or on the threshold, it's some other value. The threshold is much. Uh, and then the range of the threshold, like within these two values. Right? No. Threshold is simple threshold. Semantics doesn't change. But you are hitting the point. Answer is you cannot. Even if you try, you cannot unless you do something like what he is saying or what he is asking. Where you need to change the notion of threshold. And this, my friends, is what led to 20 years of entering deep learning. Marvin Minsky, famous AI scientist, Nobel Prize winner, Turing Award winner, he said nothing can be done in AI using this neural networks because you can't model a very simple thing like source. What is the secret source? The secret source is a concept called Linear separation. Let us see a simple way of plotting. 
if you say x, y as the two variables and you plot output, let us say and or same way you draw the structure for NAND and all, right? 0, 0, 0, because this is how AND is. Only for 1, 1 it is this. Same way for all, these are all, this is 0. Same way plot for NAND and NOR and XOR. Plot 0 works for all the five functions. You understood, right? This is 0, 0 point. This is 1, 0, 0, 1, 1, 1 point. All of you understood this? What I am plotting here? X and Y, X1, X2. If X1 is 0, Y1 is 0, origin. If X1 is 1, Y1 is 0, here. X1 is 0, Y1 is 1, here. Both are 1, here. See, draw the values. Same way, draw for NAND and NOR. Now, can you try to draw a line separating zeros and ones? In all the five. One line. Draw one line separating ones and zeros for all the five graphs. Are you able to do for all the five? For NAND? For NOR? <coughs> all of you? For XOR? Can you find this line separating zeros and ones? Single line? That is what is the secret sauce of why XOR cannot be captured by a single layer perceptron. All other functions, all other four functions you capture with some W0, W1, W2 and K threshold. But XOR it cannot because the very reason that if you plot it, there is no single way of separating ones and zeros, which is what we call as the need for linear separability. And linear separability is the exact issue, which is the reason why XOR cannot be modeled using a single layer perceptron. Got it? But if suppose I have given the possibility of drawing two lines. I can do so. So that is when people started saying that I have to give more layers. It cannot be working with a single layer perceptron. And for any more complex functions, you need to make sure that you have to go beyond a single layer perceptron. And any linearly separable function can be model using single layer perceptron. So that is the mathematical equation. Many linearly separable function. If you plot it, if you see the difference between 0 and 1, if there is a straight line separating, that means you can draw a single layer perceptron with some combination of W1, W2, W0 and K. So what do you do in case of XOR? And this lack of ability in perceptron led to a major AI winter. AI winter means a lot of years it was not considered a major part of computer science, no investments were coming into the R&D. 